Before we show you how to do a paper butterfly in this tutorial video, let me ask you a question. Did you know where origami first originated? Hmm. According to what I've read from the internet, though it is said that Japan developed origami to a very high form of art, there exists some um. Ambiguity, as there are also a mentioning of paper folding art that was burned during traditional funerals in China's Song Dynasty, which existed during 905 to 1125 CE. This art was first mentioned in a poem by Ihara Saikaku in 1680, describing the traditional butterfly designs made during Shinto weddings in Japan. However, it was the Edo period or Togugawa period, which is between 1603 and 1868, when this traditional art form of making origamis was so popular. That was interesting. In addition, it also said that Arab world was already making the same thing during the 8th century and the Moors bought paper folding to Spain during the 12th century. While origami is often considered a child's pastime in the West, it's a really long history in Japan that folding paper is enmeshed in their cultural identity. Yes, it is said that origami is the most recreational art of Japanese for centuries. They made it as a part of their cultures to foster the creativity among youngsters. Origami is served as an elegant yet amusing activity of Japanese done during their leisure times. Alright, I think we can now move on and create a paper butterfly. First, you will need to prepare all necessary materials for this tutorial. It is very simple though as we will only need a colorful square paper. The size does not matter as you can use any size based on your preference. For this example, we are using 12.5 by 12.5 cm square paper.
butterflies that you can use to decorate your home. Thanks, Thanks for watching everyone. Please, Please don't forget to subscribe to